Good evening to all truth seekers. It's Eric, your truth seeker. Tonight, I'm just recording a little video to cover a couple topics. I have now figured out how to record a video from my YouTube account, whereas I was recording it on another iPhone reading it from my other iPhone very inefficient like I said I'm visually impaired so le I'm learning as I go pretty much right now I'm looking I mean you're looking at my TV with Donald Trump on there um, I can see light through my phone so I'm hoping I'm getting a good image of the TV. Anyways, um, there's just a couple uh, words that he's going to say here in a sec. I want everybody to hear. It is quite amazing to say the least and interesting. Quite different for somebody to mention it on the world stage. All right, here we go. So if you want to hear the corporate spin, the carefully crafted lies, and the media myths, the Democrats are holding their convention next week. That was it. It's quite hilarious because uh, if you want to hear the corporate spin, the carefully crafted lies, and the media myths, insinuating US of A Inc. Hillary's carefully crafted lies and the Democrats in the White House and the media myths. We all know, the awakened people know that the media spins nothing but lies and bullshit. So for Donald Trump to call all three of those pieces of info out in the same sentence is truly an amazing historically historical event, historically. Sorry about the incorrect speaking there. Anyways, also, I would like to talk quickly and brief briefly about the global currency reset. It is on underway big time this week has started commencing private exchanges the big wigs mind you and general 64 groups and admiral groups they have started to commence exchanging or better yet redeeming our currency for sovereign rights I'm hoping these big wigs also getting the sovereign red redemption rates are doing humanitarian projects because I know myself I've got a whole list that I want to do and they would create enormous amounts of jobs down here in Canada so that being said I feel myself we as the Dinarland internet so to speak group should be getting underway within the next 10 to 15 days this is what my heart feels they've been ready for quite some time China's pissed and fed up they've devalued their currency numerous times America's pissed about that but so what look what's going on around the world and they're going to cry over a bit of spilt milk. It's going to take either the whole entire economy around the world to collapse for the elite to let this go, or we have truly won a milestone and we're going to start exchanging, like I said, within the next 10 to 15 days as the Dinarland Internet Group. Now, that being said, 
these other baskets they're talking about, like Canada and America being in the fourth basket. Sure, that sounds like a long time away, but you got to think every country that's going to be back in the currency by an asset or precious metal has to accumulate said asset or precious metal. Not too long ago, Trudeau sold off the last $200 million in gold that Canada had. So, you think we can just jump into an asset system with no gold? You know, we've been blocked every which way to send our oil lines down to the Gulf from Obama. So, like, you know, we got vast amount of minerals in the Yukon, but we got to send people up and excavate it. And, you know, if the government did that, they would charge enormous amounts of tax dollar money just to send up the excursions. So that's why once the RV commences for us internet groups, we should all think of doing stuff like that. I know I sure am. I'm going to set up a big team, go up to the Yukon, start mining diamonds and gold and silver and uranium if possible. Get it all. That way the faster we mine the, the, the assets, the faster our currency becomes worth something. Now, we could also have a big trade agreement with China or Africa or Russia or India or whomever and lease the gold from them or trade something of a value and just trade the gold for whatever we might have that they need. And hopefully it's not more land. <laughs> Anyways, that being said, this is my third video, but I have now learned how to upload a recorded video from the YouTube channel. So moving forward, I will definitely be putting out many more videos. The more I put out, the better the quality. The more I put out, the less nervous I become. I could speak in front of a thousand people and not be nervous because I'm visually impaired and I wouldn't see even a quarter of them. But when I first started doing these videos, I was more nervous than I would be doing a, a presentation in front of a thousand people. So anyways, um, yeah, keep positive, keep the faith, do good for everybody. Love everybody equally, have empathy in your hearts, and know truly in your knower that our blessing is among us, and we have been chosen from God to play a big part in liberating humanity from the shackles of the dark elitists. So remember... Love everybody equally. That is my biggest thing. Who cares what somebody's opinion says or means? Don't let it bother you. Because when you start to allow somebody's opinion to create a negative emotion inside of you, you are losing yourself. 